guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm here with my sister slash hairdresser Shirley and we are going to attempt to do the faux locks. We've already started, we started a few already because we wanted to get the hang of it because we've never done it before. With most of the faux locks I've seen on YouTube, people have been using uh, Mali hair but I decided to use um, expressions. No, sorry, I'm using Kaneko, Kaneko? Kanekalon. Kanekalon hair. Kind of, it's kind of like expressions. Basically, um, one, because I think it looks a bit neater than the Mali hair and two, it's not as expensive as the Mali hair so I could buy more hair. So yeah, anyways, if you want to see how um, we're going to achieve it, just keep on watching. Okay, so for Adela's hair, she's got quite um, sensitive scalp, so a lot of tension is not really good for her hair. What we're using is some yarn, just to allow it to hold more and to give it a lightweight feel so it doesn't pull too much on her hair. What we're going to do is just basically braid it like we would a normal, a normal braid. So what this will do, it will give the it will give us a solid foundation to be able to wrap the hair around it and create the faux locks. Initially for the beginning I'm doing this bit where her hair is quite tight just to ensure that it doesn't slip out and then as I cane row down I'm just making it looser so it can give me more body to wrap up the hair around. So you get a piece of um, jumbo braid and just ensure that you've picked it and it's got a pointy end. If you fold it a little bit, you just add it to the hair that you're about to um, wrap. And you want to begin wrapping around the braid itself as opposed to the hair. Or else you'll get even more tension and the client will probably leave your house with a sore brain. <laughs> As you get to the end of your braid, just keep wrapping it round till it goes. And then you continue adding a bit more to it. And again, you want to start with a little bit on the end and then work your way round it. to braid the sections that you need and then go ahead and wrap the hair as opposed to braiding and then wrapping then moving on to the next round. So we've braided the majority of it and we're just wrapping the rest of the braids that's left. And then we're done. And then we're done. So we finally finished um, after, <laughs> I don't know, like six, seven hours. But all we're going to do now is click my sides because they're growing out and then I'm done. And we're done. I love it so much. It's so heavy, but I'll get used to it. Thank you, Shirley. Where'd you change the jubilee line? <laughs> never, doing it never doing it again. <laughs> Go to sleep. <laughs> so yeah, guys, hope you like it. Um, be sure to leave a comment down below and like the video if you did. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Mwah.